Hello! Phew! How's it going, guys? I understand it's been a while, and I'm sure no one cares that I haven't posted in a couple weeks. I had my birthday. That was a thing. It happened. It was March 1st, Ash Wednesday, beginning of Lent. Let me tell you, it has been quite a time, really. And I did turn 21. My birthday is February 29th, but you already know that. Turn 21, that is in this country at least the legal age for drinking alcohol. Hmm. So what do you expect? Of course, my bro takes me out to a bar for my B-Day. To this new bar. It's been reopened, actually. It's not that new. It's starting like 67 or something. It's here in my city, right? It's being on some TV show called uh, Bar Buster or Bar Rescue, I believe is the name of the show. Bar Rescue's there, and so there's a line as far as the eye can see. It's really not that long. Maybe a hundred people in line. It's not that many people. Oh, by the way, they never carded me once. And I understand for most people, why would they want to be carded? Why is that something? Someone would want to happen to them. I want to be carded. I am a four foot eleven, twelve year old looking person. I want nothing less than to be carded. I want them to look at me in the eyes and say, "Hey, tiny squeak squeaker. Hey, short stuff. Hey, short stuff. What are you doing here? You get your little behind out of our bar. See? I want you out of here." I'd be like, "Sir, this here is my California state ID. I want you to take a good look at it, and you tell me again to get out of here, Buster." Because I won't. I will not get out of here. The law allows me to be in here. I mean, you can deny me service, but but, but I'm speaking legally, speaking, not because of my age. You can't kick me out because of my age. Because I'm 21 years old, see? 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 Now, I'm not going to show you my ID because I don't want you stealing my identity. Try again next. So we're waiting in line, and they're getting the place ready. Bar Rescue's doing a little interview inside. And we wait in that line for a real long time. I want to say two hours. We get to the front. So I go on in, right? I'm right in there. Finally, two hours long wait, and I look around, and it is a bar that only serves beer. They only serve beer. Beer, huh? Beer. To the average alcohol drinker, the normal college student, they're like, oh, gee whiz. Gee willikers, I love me some beer, but I'm a fancier lad than that, sir. I'm a, I'm a gent. I don't like me a beer. I like me a hard cold liquor or some whiskey. So I'm sitting there and I'm thinking, I want a glass of wine. I want some Jamesons. I want some good stuff. Well, at least maybe someone will buy me a drink. So I hear, you know, it's your 21st birthday. You show up and you say, hey, you know, it's my 21st birthday, huh? What do you got for me? And they go, oh my God. It's your 21st birthday. I gotta get you a drink, kid. I gotta get you something free, you know? I'm gonna buy you something right now. You know, I got plenty of happy birthdays, but not a single person offered to pay for my drink. So, you know, I think, yeah, who am I to feel entitled that somebody buy me a drink on my 21st birthday? It's bullshit. I'm not a douchebag. Who am I to say these things? So, I go up to the front, some pretty looking bartenders up there, and I say, hey, Chica. Hey, Chica. How about you get me one of them 16 ounce beers, huh? And she says, what kind? I said, lady, I've never had any before. I don't know what the kinds are. And she says, there's this, this, and this. And I show my bro the list. And he says, ah, you should go with this. So I go up there. I mean, I'm still up there. I never moved, right? I was still standing there. So I'm up there. I look the lady in the eye and I ask her for my beer. So I get the beer, I take a drink, and I go, I don't like this, it's beer. Uh, so I try real hard to drink half of it. My, my brother ends up finishing the rest of it. That's all the alcohol I had at that bar. I don't like beer. I don't like beer. I don't like beer. Now here's where the games begin. So the day ends, right? I go to school the next day and nobody really asks. Nobody really cares. So I carry on with my life and then the weekend comes, huh? Now this weekend, this is my 21st birthday weekend. I did go wine tasting with my family. A little fancy fancy, huh? With the, with the pay rent. They took me to Santa Barbara. You know, Santa Barbara. Santa Barbara, California. Oh. Saturday was the day we went wine tasting. I didn't want any alcohol Sunday. Did not want any alcohol Sunday. I was in a bad mood Sunday. Not a hangover, I was just being a bitch. So my dad goes to this wine tasting convention, but it's all Pinot Noir, and I don't like Pinot Noir. So my mom takes me to about seven different wine tasting wineries in the, you know, the downtown Santa Barbara. So go to seven places, I'd say six glasses at each place, but I'm not a big drinker. I don't drink much. I've literally only been drunk two other times in my life, and I mean, I have wine every Sunday at church, but whatever, okay? I'm not a big drinker, so I say, Mommy, will you split these cups with me? 
I don't think I'm, you know, experienced enough. So we split it, and then my, one of my brothers is there, two different brothers. He's there, he also has some boats. So we split it about three ways. Seven wineries, multiply that times about five, six cups. I don't know how you want to do the math there. That's how many cups of wine I had, and I want to say three hours. It was too much for the first time. You'd be doing that with your parents, you know? We go back to the hotel, my parents and me and my bros and some friends of my dad's because he was going to this convention with these guys, yada, yada, yada. It just so happened that there were some wine bottles that some people purchased that night. So while the rest of them, seven people split two bottles, I may or may not have had two thirds of a bottle all to myself in one hour. I, I downed it, I downed it pretty quick. The only thing that stopped me is I got a little too dizzy to pick up the bottle. It was getting kind of heavy, and uh, there was a lot of crawling that took place, some drunk texts. That's about it. Pretty basic stuff. I threw up for a good half an hour. Went to bed, slept, slept pretty well. Okay, now here's a video. I don't want you to feel like you're left out. I'm not doing inside jokes. I'm not being a douche. It's not funny because of something someone said. It was funny because I was drunk. Okay. <sighs> huh. Why is it broke? It's not broke. Oh, it's good. We're good. We're good. We're good. I'm doing it. Daddy, I'm recording. <laughs> what? Where is it? I don't see it. Oh. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> you asked for it. <laughs> It's cool. That's all I've got for you today. I hope I'm back next week. I just been kind of busy with school. Okay, sounds good, guys. Uh, love ya. Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks.